After 20 years serving as the mayor of Auburn, Norman Yoder will be passing the baton to someone else. Fox 55's Gentil Nilt talked to the mayor and the two candidates who are hoping to sit in the seat to serve the people of Auburn. 1999 was an interesting year for Mayor Norman Yoder. He was sworn into office a day later than expected for the national fear of Y2K. But we're still here with advanced technology, and so is he, 20 years later. Oh, it's, been a, it's been a real rewarding uh, term of office. 20 years is a long time uh, to sit as mayor. This is his last year in office. Two of the things he's most proud of during his time of leadership are Reiki Park and providing Auburn Central Services. Every home and business has fiber connected to it, which helps high-speed internet access. We were one of the few first communities that was kind of a leap into the 21st century, and one of the first communities to actually have fiber to the home, and still one of the very, very few that have actually done it as a city utility. But he says now is the time to move on and give someone else a chance to lead. What would be your message for uh, the candidate who comes uh, after you? I don't know if I really have talked to both of them. They're both very qualified. Uh, my message would be to put the city of Auburn and the 13,000 people you work for first. Democrat Sarah Payne and Republican Mike Lay are vying to fill Yoder's shoes. Mayor Yoder has created a great legacy here. Um, I think for me, it really boils down to the fact that he's created a foundation that is really just ready for somebody to come in and use to catapult the community to the next level. So I thought, well, we've got a good mayor and, and he's been here 20 years. So, you know, that just kind of set aside. Well, then last September 21st, when Mayor Yoder announced he wasn't going to seek re-election, it's like, okay, now I see what this is all about. Mayor Yoder's last day in office is December 31st of this year. He says when he leaves, he and his wife are going to do some traveling. In Auburn, Gentil Nil, Foss 55 News.